what's going on y'all so it's saturday morning it is cold out you can see my window shield still has frost on it even though i've been running my car for several minutes but i am going to head to lowe's to do a manly project um even though when it comes to any sort of home renovation home repair i, I am not a manly man but i have a a subfloor in our workout room that i damage by dropping uh, so my bumper plates when I was doing a workout and uh, there's this this hole uh, in my floor and uh, So I thought you know what I could hire somebody to do it But I just feel like manning up and taking care of it So it's Saturday morning about seven o'clock in the morning and I'm heading to Lowe's to get what I need to do uh, As far as what do I need? I know what I need. You know why because I watched some YouTube videos last night So yeah, I'm I'm so ready for this so ready I just hope I don't like uh, cut a hole in, a, in like a pipe or uh, uh, a gas line or some electric uh, some electricity wires. I mean that's what Mandy was warning me last night. So uh, yeah. So anyway, let's head to Lowe's and see what I need. I don't know why, but I'm feeling pretty, pretty proud of myself. The fact that uh, there is nobody in the parking lot, like nobody. And here I am, 7 a.m., and I am getting the floor done. So uh, what can I say? I am a manly man. Let's do this. Ready to do this. All right, so I have to admit, one of the reasons why I don't do home construction projects is because whenever I come to Lowe's like this, I don't even know where to start. Like, I don't, I don't know where to start. Like, I kind of know what I need, but then I get here, and like, there's just so much stuff. It's almost like if I was shopping for female clothes and walking to Nordstrom and like there's just like so many options like it just it drives me I just get overwhelmed I'm in the screw aisle. I feel like I'm screwed clearly clearly Okay, I've been here for like 12 minutes I think I got the screws I don't even know what else I need. I'm lost. I just want to go home. <laughs> I quit So one of the things I love about coming to Lowe's is that everybody that works here wants to let you know how much they know, how long they've been doing it, and it only just plays into that whole shame of being a man. But anyway, I am got what I need, got some uh, plywood, got my two by fours, got my screws. Now I just need a jigsaw. I got a lot of choices over here. Let me get a good one. I don't know what that means. I'm just gonna jig it up, jig, jig, jig. So here's the best part. I didn't even started the project yet. I didn't even started the project yet. And, uh, and I've already, hope you can see this. I've already cut myself. <laughs> I'm already injured. Uh, just like trying to, shh, 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 radio. Uh, trying to get the plywood off of the shelf there. I, almost like a paper cut. This is the worst. I'm already injured. I'm so, I'm so embarrassed. All right. I think I got everything. Got the two by fours. I got me a jigsaw. I got uh, some gloves <laughs> that I needed earlier, uh, and then just for fun, some caution tape because I feel like this is going to be a dangerous area uh, that's going on. So, you know, that's, that's what we do. All right, let's go home and get this thing started. So I'm just getting all the materials in and getting ready to get this job started. And I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have a little helper because Nella has been ready to help out. Are you gonna help daddy out with this project? Boys! What? Boys! Boys, it looks like lips. Boys! 
Yeah, that's not your candy though, is it? It's boys. It's boys, that's right. Nella, are you willing to help daddy? Yes. She wants to help me, but what she doesn't know, oh, I don't know if you've seen this yet, but I got the caution tape up, you know, just in case. I wanna make sure everybody's safe. Hello. Bye bye. And then I've got, this is actually Mandy's saw. I'm using this to cut in this floor. And then I've got to put some lines down using this bad boy. And there's my jigsaw. I think I'm missing something else. Who knows? I'll figure it out. All right, so here, here's, here's the, 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 the problem. And this is why this is like above my pay grade. So I've drawn the lines where I think I need to saw and the floor joist is underneath here. So I'm okay with that, but if the joist is here and I've got a crack here, does that mean I need to cut all the way over here? I think I just answered my own question. Oh dear Lord. Bentley, do you think I got this? No. <laughs> wait, 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 who do you think should be doing this? Me or your mom? <laughs> that's that's the confidence I have in my children. They don't. They respect. They they know that their dad's got the shoe game on point. But when it comes to like doing this stuff, no confidence. Wait, do you think I'm better at coaching or doing like home repair? Don't say neither. It's hard to tell. Hard to tell. Well, this is the kid I coach too. Well, I'm the assistant coach, but I have taught him everything he knows. He just doesn't realize that. Anyway, that's a whole other story. Right now we're talking about a hole in the floor that we're going to figure this out. All right, so I'm actually embarrassed to admit this. So I got Mandy's saw here and I know because I watched YouTube videos that this blade does not want to go further down than the three quarter width of the plywood of the floor. What I don't know is I don't see how I can actually make this thing go higher up or if I need to swap out the blade. Cause if I'm being honest, I've never really used one of these. So, Right now, I'm actually trying to watch a YouTube video to find out what the guy said to do. Because I don't know if we have another blade. I, I don't know. I don't know. It's 11.15 and I, I've, I've drawn lines to go to Lowe's. Draw line, and I've drawn lines. That's what I've got. We've got a game at two o'clock, so uh, I'm not sure if we're gonna get this done. Before that, I didn't think I would, but hopefully today. Whew, that's wishful thinking. All right, y'all, so I, I can't even make this up. So as I was just get more of the tools out. So I got the jigsaw. I got this puppy out and I pull it out. And I'm like, wait, okay, no battery. I mean, I can do without a battery. Probably use one of our drill batteries for that. I'm like, where's the blade? And then I'm actually looking at the box and it says tool only, tool only. So no blades, seriously, seriously. All right, so Mandy is back from Whole Foods and she was insistent on helping me out with the whole saw situation. And I think she's currently updating our neighbors because we, I had a group text thread going, updating them on my progress. I didn't, I didn't even talk about the toilet. That, that's a whole, we won't even talk about that. Whole other video. But uh, Mandy, I did help her out, but together we figured out no. how, how to figure out. How to adjust the saw. I get back and you're like, I don't know how to work the saw. Like, I'm like. Is it, is it, okay. First of all, can we just talk about this? Did you already talk about this? When he's going to Lowe's this morning, I'm like, what, wait, what are you buying? What are you buying? And he's like, oh, he named all the, the things, but I knew he was buying a tool. And he was like, in a jigsaw thing. And I was like, oh, okay. But he doesn't really know that the jigsaw doesn't come with blades or a battery. So like people who are into tools would know, you don't go buy a different brand 
of a jigsaw that needs a battery. Look how good this thing looks though. When you have like, we have quarter cable. Look how good this yeah. looks. That have batteries that you can swap out with all your tools. So he buys DeWalt, which is only the See, circular. because I saw the DeWalt bag. I mean, but, this is what but, I saw. Wait, no, hold on, hold on. I saw that. But our regular saws don't need like removable batteries. So there's, first of all, there's that. You should have checked what the drill was. I feel like maybe. You're right in the kitchen, you open the like buffet, there's like. Walking out and I saw, I saw the battery. DeWalt bag and I'm like, DeWalt, yeah. You seem like a DeWalt chick. I mean, the fact that you would put up caution tape is just, that says everything. Because how many projects have I done and I've never in my life put up caution tape? Hey, well, we're gonna cut a floor here. We don't want people stepping in. Did you also oh, notice that it's. Did you notice that it's multilingual too, just in case? I just, I'm just, like don't, don't attempt this without me. You just have to appreciate that I'm the tool girl. Like, I, I don't understand. I would never try to go like be a videographer without you and be like, I got this, no, don't even tell me how to work the lens. But this is so, this is the, 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 the fun is the process. Isn't that right, Nella? The fun would be doing it together, but you want to like prove me wrong, which is not working because I'm now proving that you're, not really, um, yeah, don't worry, I just text your friends. <laughs> <laughs> I got this. <laughs> in the p.m. No progress. Primarily because my youngest son Sloan had a basketball game. I'm a coach. Had to go do that. Parker has, I'm sorry, no, he already, he played same time. Bentley's got a game at six o'clock, so I gotta wrap this up in an hour. I'm obviously not gonna get done with this before the game, maybe tonight, but I finally have figured out what I'm going to do. I think we're gonna saw. Let's see what happens. So made most of the cuts. They're not the prettiest of lines. I'm still a little worried because I gotta take the saw over where the floor joist is and 
I just might use that little little hacksaw that Mandy brought because yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I trust myself, but. So yeah, need to, a little there, a little crooked there. But in case you're wondering why I determined this size, to make it easier on myself, I thought, okay, let me just go ahead and take the width of the board. So I can only have to make one cut here, plop that puppy right in there. And then we gotta cut some two by fours. Have to put one here, connect this floor joist, connect this joist, and then two more here. And am I missing something? I feel like I'm missing something. Might have to go this way, but we'll figure that out once I get a bigger hole in my floor. Okay, it's officially day two. I've got my caution tape on. I've got Elsa over here getting her fingernails nails painted. She's getting ready to go to a birthday party. I feel like I'm ready for this. I just, I don't really know what I'm starting with, but I did have to put the caution tape on. It's right there. You think I got this today, babe? <laughs> you told me to wow. stay out of it. You don't want wow. my help. You don't want anything. Wow, did, so you, did you, that initial like laugh of, I'm just trying to remain um, absent from this project. Otherwise, I'll get bossy. You're, and you'll, you're, I think you're just fearful that your husband's gonna lose like a limb. No, I'm just um, thinking like tools are my thing, like shoes are your thing. And I'm just like, you know, just, just saying if I was gonna buy some shoes. I would get your advice, but you were like, I got this, leave me alone. That's what I'm doing. All right, now I am the man. I am the man that does not want to stop at the gas station ask for, ask for directions. I'm just going, I'm just going. All right, so this is what the scene looks like right now. I had to put the vacuum chop bag over there to cover up the hole. And uh, yeah, let's find out what, what I'm gonna do first. Okay, actually I figured out what, what step one is. Step one is like, I know that I have to do some cuts. I've got to cut the plywood, I've got to cut the two by fours, and I can use the table saw. But Mandy has, this is actually her birthday gift to herself uh, from me that she bought for herself, but from me. You follow that? Anyway, so this hasn't been set up yet. So we got the stand here, we got this here. So I'm actually gonna set this up so then I can make the cuts needed uh, for the next step. So that's what we're gonna do right now. All right, so finally got this thing put together. Uh, it took a little while because we had a friend drop off another kid that I was watching while Mandy's at a, that birthday shower. So. This is together. Now I gotta measure the plywood. I'm gonna cut that first so I can get that cut. I'm actually gonna use this bad boy. And then from there, I'll start cutting the two by fours for the, uh, the floor joist support, something. I think that's the right terminology. Close enough, close enough. Let's get to cutting. So I got the cuts done. Wasn't the greatest cut. I obviously don't know how to use this thing yet and that's okay. So I'm gonna see if I can take this piece in now. I'm gonna rip out the other piece and hopefully this fits. I feel like I'm gonna have to shimmy it down a little bit. Actually, I know I'm, I know I'm gonna have to because I didn't cut it straight. We'll find out.
All right, so it is the moment of truth to see if the cut actually worked. I don't think it's going to. So close, so close, but not close enough. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie, I'm, I'm feeling a bit defeated right now. Uh, it's two hours later, I think, I've been shaving and shaving this down, trying to get it to fit, and I'm like a sixteenth of an inch away. I really wish I had a jigsaw right now. <laughs> really wish I would've bought some blades and a battery. I should've went back and got it, but I'm like, no, I can do this. I can do this, and I'm still going to do this, but I need a minute. I need a minute. Uh, and I'm gonna cook some steaks for dinner. I don't, it ain't getting, it ain't getting done tonight. <laughs> Why? Tomorrow's a holiday though. Tomorrow is a school holiday, so I will have time tomorrow to finish this project. Yes, it will happen. 